Okay, this is a first impressions video. Oh. This is my hat. Respect is earned. Beatings are free. This is the fire home that I'm going to be putting what's in this box in. This is a fail zero BCG. I had ordered three days ago, four days ago. Uh, ordered it on a Sunday. It shipped Monday. And today is Wednesday. I have opened this up once before and I already looked at it. It's kind of hard to do. Okay. So, as you can see, Fell Zero M16 BCG. Nickel Baron. I was going to go with the spikes, but Primary Almonds was having a deal on these for $109 compared to $200 for the spike. I know Fail Zero does the coating on the spikes. So I said, hey, can't really go long, wrong with $109. All right, let's open it up. Not easy to do on camera, holding my phone with the other hand. So you get your little pan for it. Tells you about the fail zero. And this is the BCG. Got your fail zero markings. It actually is beautiful. Uh, I heard a few things about sometimes people getting ones with, you know, loose gas keys not properly staked. As you can see, that gas key is probably is staked well. No issues with there. <clears throat> There's no tooling to or any kind of scuffs or scrapes or anything on it. It is great. There's your Feral Zero I'm walking on a bolt. Okay, see if I can take this apart with one hand. Check out the firing pin. Firing pin is nice. It is the same coating as the boat carrier, the nickel bar on. Done very well. The cam pin, also nickel bar on. No markings. It's beautiful. Everything's really nice. So far, I'm very happy with this. Let's take out the bolt. All right. The bolt. No machining or markings messed up anywhere. Now, a lot of people say that the uh, fail zero does not say um, MPI, HPT, magnetic, magnetic particle inspected and high pressure tested. Um, a lot of people say their bolts don't, but let's see if I could zoom in. If it would focus, come on, focus. Right there. 
HPI. MPI, HPT MPI, high pressure tested, magnetical particle inspected. The boat is beautiful like the rest of it. It came out great. Now here's the part that I'm going to have to, uh, not sure if I could do one handed. I'm going to pull the boat itself apart yeah I'm gonna have to set the phone down y'all let's see I'll use my hat right here Okay. Wow, uh, what can I use? I'll use my knife. It's got a small enough tip to where I should be able to push in the net. Alright, let's see if we can get it. Okay. Alright. Okay, as you can see, got that apart. It does have the O-ring. And I think it's a, I'm gonna pull this little ring off real quick. Not easy to do. Let's see, one, two, three. All right, maybe I'll shake that a little bit. One, two, three, four. Looks like a five cold spring. And uh, I gotta say, I am happy with the Fail Zero BCG, with the Fail, Fail Zero Boat Carrier Group. It is not as shiny as I would have expected, but it is ridiculously smooth. I mean, it feels like there's oil on it. And there's no oil. But it definitely feels like it. Like it's slippery. But. <sighs> happy with it. That's the end of my video. Thumbs up. So far for a fail zero. BCG. I don't know what that is on there. It's not scraped or nothing. Not tool marks. Yeah, I think I just got something on it. Uh, thumbs up. I can't wait to uh, run it through my gun. I have the Fostec Echo Trigger in this one. As you can see. And uh, that is my... This is my main AR. It's an AR pistol. I'm actually about to change out my receiver set, uh, upper and lower. Instead of a billet, I'm gonna go with a forge, just spikes, upper and lower. The billets are a lot heavier and I wanna make this a little bit lighter. It ain't, ain't gonna be much, maybe a couple ounces, but hey, a little bit lighter is better. All right. Thank y'all for watching.